Stop watching me. Stop watching me. Yeah, yeah, Cameras yeah. on everywhere I go, <laughs> even this guy. Welcome back to the lab with Leo, and I ought to be used to the cameras by now. This is Patrick Norton. He's used to the cameras. He's on DL.TV uh, every single, well, twice a week. Every Tuesdays other day. and Thursdays. Tuesdays and Thursdays. And then he's also, of course, a long time friend of mine, my cohort on the screensavers for many, many years. You knew and me it, when I was a child. It's, <laughs> you were so young. <laughs> it's, uh, the, funny, the funny thing is, uh, you know, we, we've watched as many things have evolved. I remember when we first started doing the screensavers, you were so excited because they were hard drive MP3. Remember the, what was it, the, you put it in the car? PJ was, Walters, oh. There was the PJB. I'm not even going to get into the car And then there was the car one. Like, and we were very excited, and the PJB was expensive PJB and 100, hard to but it, use. But it sounded magnificent, it had a good display, you could actually maneuver through and files. And then Apple comes along, <laughs> boom, everything's gone. It's all changed. We've seen this happen so many times, now we're seeing it uh, with camcorders. And I've been waiting for this to happen, to move away from tape to solid-state camcorders. A lot of solid-state camcorders. Normally, you think of that, you think about a $500 price point, uh, Sony, I want to say I love JVC. my Sanyo Exacti, I love. That's nice, that's a little more expensive, that's six, about 750 seven, nine, Six or 700 bucks. Yeah. It's also an HD camcorder. Right. Um, nice thing about hard drive camcorders is you store hours of video on that hard drive. Right. Now you're going to talk about like 500 plus, and you want to make sure that your uh, your your video editing software will actually work with the. Well, video that's that the comes thing because you can't just pop a tape out. You you got to get yeah. it off onto the computer each time. So now these are these are flash based, right? Yeah, these are flash based. These are these are a step down. Right. Let's say you've got you, 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 you your neighbor always has the you know video camera in their car when the space aliens come to you know, <laughs> He's their waiting. parking lot. Someday they will. Some people, somebody, the, somebody, a lot of the paparazzi video, whatever you want to call it, whatever your thing is. Maybe you got kids, right? And your kids like I want. To make movies, and right. you're thinking, I want to have Spielberg but I as a my child. Kid, yeah, but I give my kid a seven hundred dollar camcorder. Exactly. So these, so we've got two of the models here. We've got this one here is from Ape Tech. It's the iCam. Wait a minute. Ape A I P T E K. I need a new name. Okay, Ape Tech. Ape these Tech? are probably both Taiwanese country companies. Uh, yeah, I and when Pure Digital actually, and the Pure Digital also, this is called the the Flip, and this is also known uh, by RCA, and I'm sure they actually have a, another brand. They're branding it under in Canada, but basically these are both sell for about 100 to 120 dollars, wow. depending on where you're buying them. They record to SD cards. They record the Ape Tech records through an SD card, so you can throw up to a two gigabyte SD card in there. Um, the Flip, which is the one over here, has 512 megabytes or one gigabyte of RAM. It's which, built in. Exactly. Yeah. It's basically 30 or 60 gigabytes of video. And you can't add more? No. But you can flip out the little oh, look USB. At that. I mean, it's, it's literally designed to be a self contained It's happy to see you. <laughs> well, that's great. So, And it's got a little bit thing on the back. Now, uh, so that's not a camcorder form factor. This is no. more like a camcorder. I mean, this one, you're basically, it's a little weird. You can use it left handed or right handed. You've right. got a big record button on the back. You've got a play button. It's a lovely screen, actually. I don't know if you can see the screen. There. It's, it's a, tiny, but it's the tiny, but good. it's a good-looking screen. The screen in the Apex not so lovely, but it'll do 640 by 480 and 720 by 480 video. They so call what it will D1. This do? So that's 640 by 480. 640 by 480. Okay, that's VGA quality. That's it's not so really, bad. Both of them do 640 by 480. Okay. Just the Apex will do 720 by 480. Is also. it 720p? Is it high def? It's 30 frames per second. It's, it's high def tough. Remember, high, the problem with like high, high def, you get like lots of pixels. You get you know lots of right. data coming into it. But you not know what? That. It's a, you know well. Look, Not you for know, 100 bucks. <laughs> a lot of a good video camera is the cost of the glass and the processing electronics, right. and right. they're not spending That's a lot of money. Right. Yeah. But what's what was kind of amazing about the the Ape Tech the. Uh, the uh, iCam is it's also an MP3 player and it's also a digital still camera. So <laughs> yeah, it waxes the floor. <laughs> I, yeah, I feel like I'm advertising the Paso Manic, right? Um, but how good is the quality? The quality you could be bad. I got some videos on here. Right. We we were shooting some in the background. These are going to look a little worse than they should because I'm connected into your your network. Yeah, system you're, you're processing out through a lot of stuff. So, and you're watching it on a TV at home. So uh, on a computer though, that's a pretty challenging playback. Here we go. And there's absolutely nothing. You know, I think we should turn the lights up. Hmm. Oh, you know why? Because we're getting overlay video. You're going to have to shoot that. That's all right. Glenn, why don't you shoot that? We'll turn it around. That's just typical. You get over... How am I talking? My voice and my lips aren't matched. It's very... It's also out of focus. Can we get... There we go. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> you, you were out of focus? That's actually... Uh, that's the video coming off Let's of... Let's do another one. ...the Ape Tech. And that's the Ape Tech. That's the Ape Tech. I mean, they're not... Look, this is not spectacular video quality. You know, it's fine for the internet. Absolutely. I mean, I, use, I, I shoot a lot of video now with my camera phone, because, now you, just because it's there. Let's see this. All it's right. a little, the, the image off the pure digital is a little softer. Um, lighting's a little, you can kind of see the I'm seeing jaggies, skittles. though, up here. The jaggies you know? are more from the resizing, because my screen's being resized, so I can plug oh, okay, into okay. To the big, cool guy well, it's not working, so if you, <laughs> you want to get a normal, normal size, you can. Well, I can, here, I can do that. Because yeah, we'll we're not getting the, it's overlay video. Hold this up for a second. That. 
to go ahead and open up the side of it. Okay. There's a little power button inside the manual. There. All right. You open Let up that see. while okay. I'm resizing the yeah. screen. All right. Now, you know something Here's really interesting? Button. Okay. That'll yeah. start up. Now, hit yeah. that power button. Once the video starts up, hit the power button a second time. Okay. And then turn around and face the camera towards your face. Okay. Now, ah, oh, it's bright. Yes. There's got a, it's got a flash on it. Holy yes. kamoly. It's, not only got a, it's got a still flash, but it also has two LED lights on it that will allow you to do some, a little bit of night photography up close. Uh, you could do dental work. You could do dental work. Yeah. I yeah. hope you didn't press record when you're doing that, because that's <laughs> really going to spook me later on. <laughs> I want to see this on DLTV. It mm, may well happen. Inside Leo's mouth. Mm. And now that's that's kind of neat. I mean, now, is that going to kill the battery like crazy? It's, it's not going to do great things for the battery, but it runs on a couple of double A's. You pick up blue dot batteries and you can actually see it does like five megapixel and eight megapixel pictures. Well, the stills as yeah. well. So if you if you see the stills coming up on here. Um, Those aren't bad. No, it's 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 like it's like a 1998 camera where it's a little it's, smooth, where you, soft, right? Yeah. Yeah. And you sort of aim it and you hold it for a second and then you hear the shutter noise. So it's really easy to. Oh, uh, that's it's like a camera phone in that respect. Yeah, it's yeah. it's a little old school. Remember, you're you know you're talking about a hundred dollar device, but uh, it's 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 a fun little gadget. If you want something you can this travel with, this would be great with. for giving the kids. Yes. Uh, yeah, exactly. You say put it in the glove compartment for when the aliens come. You'll and, and you know films like that should be slightly blurry. Well, it's part of the. Uh, it's part of the. Eth yeah, exactly. The ethic. Uh, if you get the Loch Ness monster on this, now you can see the video when it's when it's scaled okay. normally. Let's 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 zoom in on that. Can we see it? Because that's that's going to look a, a little bit better for the steady cam. It's not. You're right. The jaggies are gone. You Thirty frames per second. That's pretty good. Yeah. When you're talking about this, you know, a hundred dollar camera, you pick up an SD card or you grab an old SD card, throw it into there. You got the ability to grab thirty minutes an hour of video. You've got a still camera built in there. It's 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 pretty cool. I'm actually having a lot of I'm fun impressed. with the Apex. Can you get a video out? Could you just use this as a webcam or no? Um, I haven't tried I using it as a webcam. It does have the ability to go out to your, both these have the ability to go out to your television. So you could use I'll it try for using X, it as a webcam for see what stick happens. Stick them or, or Ustream or that kind of thing. Very so, cool. We have details on both the, the Ape Co. Ape Tech. <laughs> Ape Tech. <laughs> and, and the what? And the Pure Digi Digital. Pure flip. Digital <laughs> on the website, labwithleo.com. And uh, Patrick Norton is at dl.com. TV. It's so great to see you back. My pleasure. This is fun. And what did Customs think when you tried to bring this into the country? There were a lot of questions. <laughs> You're not going to leave these here. You're not going to undermine the Canadian economy and leave these two cameras here. You know, that's much funnier now than when I'm staring at the guy with the gun and the bulletproof vest. <laughs> we'll be back with more of your calls in just a bit. You stay right here.